a ruffle of a just landed in a, in a tree just a little further back there. In this difficult time the world experiencing right now, I just wanted to go out one more time in the height of the birds of prey, take my camera out and just reconnect to nature once again. Good morning, I'm going to try one last time this season here in the height of bird, birds of prey. So yeah, I have rigged myself with my D4S and my 500 millimeter and yeah, I just cross my finger and hope, hope there will come some birds today. Started to rain, still no bird. Just have to have patience. It's nice to, to hear the rain when you are inside. There's a goshawk now. It's this goshawk with the reared beak. I was actually relaxing uh, with my eyes closed. I think I maybe dipped a little bit off, but I hope that uh, I will be prepared when the castle lands. And I hope that it will land in this little perch that I found for it. But I don't know if it did land there first or not, because suddenly I just wake up and it was, yeah, on the ground. Yeah, I had to go get up five o'clock in the morning. Rough like a buzzard move a little bit around so it looks like looks like it's just waiting for the goshawk to fly away but it just stands still. It won't move at all. So the rough like a buzzard is back and forward sitting in the trees just a little further back. It's been a really great season of the Birds of Prey. I really had some great moments with the buzzard and rough-legged buzzard and goshawks 
Um, yeah, that's been really, really nice. So with the rough like a this gun and a Corsica's gun. Uh, so I thought I'd just show you a little bit uh, of um, the season of the birds of prey. I hope you enjoy it. Thank you for watching and I will see you next time. Really nice light.